Rebecca and Oliver want to thank every single one of you for being here with us today. So many wonderful people coming from all sorts of different places. So many of you traveled for miles and miles, others from much less, but all with the same exciting goal in mind, which is this amazing occasion. So welcome to the wedding of Rebecca and Oliver. Thank you everyone for coming. It's uh, lovely to see you all here, so many faces. I can't find my pen. I just need to cross it out on the door. <laughs> thanks for coming. I think I said that one. But well, that one, thanks. Anyway. <laughs> Next one. The beautiful bridesmaids, everyone. Um, thank you very much. We gathered here today in the sight of God and in the presence of one another to join this man and this woman in holy matrimony and to seek God's blessing and grace on their behalf. Who gives this woman to be married to this man? I do. <laughs> Thank you very much. You may now be seated. And ours is a sacred place where we both belong. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a token of the covenant. As a token of the covenant. Made between us this made, day. Made between us this day. And as a pledge of our mutual love. As a pledge of our mutual love. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a token of the covenant. As a token of this covenant. Made between us this day. Made between us this day. And as a pledge of our mutual love. As a, and, a, and as a pledge of our mutual love. For as much as Oliver and Rebecca have consented together in holy matrimony before God and in the presence of this great company and have pledged faithfulness to each other by the giving and receiving of rings and by the joining of hands, I now pronounce them to be husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, those whom God has joined, let no man separate. You may now kiss your bride. Thank you for um, coming to uh, celebrate this wonderful day uh, with uh, Oliver and Rebecca. Um, my name is Kevin. I'm the father of the bride, if you don't know. Yeah! On that day when Oliver decided he would like to marry uh, Rebecca, he did the, uh, the traditional thing and he came to see me. 
to ask for Rebecca's hand in marriage. I did tell him that it's taken him a bit of time to get out of doing that. So I was wanting to sort it out before he did. So Oliver, welcome to the family. You're, joining, you're, you're actually joining a loyal, a loving family. And to finish off, you've got to remember that a happy wife is a happy life. Yeah. So ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to ask you to please stand and raise your glass. Join me in the toast for the two VIPs for today. So, to my beautiful daughter and my new son-in-law, Becky Oliver. I'm not really good at saying soppy things, as Becky will know. When I proposed, I had a huge list of things to say. I basically got down on one knee and said, uh, I love you, I think you're meant. Do you want to marry me? <laughs> um, so yeah. But so, yeah, I'm not very good at saying things, but um, I do love you. Thank you. <laughs> and I think you're meant. Um, um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say other than you're incredible. Um, I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. It's going to be amazing. Um, yeah. So, if we could all raise a glass to my wife, Rebecca, because she's mint.